tornadoes ripped through the south on Thursday and Friday, leaving devastation in their paths. A massive storm called a supercell spawned at least six tornadoes in Alabama and stretched all the way into Georgia, where another tornado touched down early Friday morning. That storm killed at least one person in Noonan, a town outside of Atlanta, and left heavy damage. This was where a front door was of the home that is collapsed. The couple, Mary Rose and Larry DeArmond, were right there under the collapse. They were trapped. Their neighbors brought those ladders. They climbed out. They were injured, went to the hospital, but not badly enough to not return. And we just met with them moments ago, and they actually found, Mary Rose found her purse in all of this. Fresh from the hospital, the couple telling us their story. Lori, house started shaking, then everything came in on us. In Alabama's Calhoun County, north of Birmingham, at least five people died in the storm. Hundreds of homes and businesses suffered damage from winds that reportedly reached more than 100 miles per hour. Thousands of Alabama and Georgia residents remain without power. Alabama Governor Kay Ivey declared a state of emergency for dozens of counties. According to the Weather Channel, tornadoes also touched down in Tennessee and Mississippi. And as of Friday morning, residents across the South were still taking stock of the destruction.